Hello, John. I heard about your wife. I'm sorry, my condolences. It um, seemed to be fate. Or happenstance or just bad fucking luck caused our paths to cross once again. John, let us not resort to our baser instincts and handle this like civilized men to move on. Shit! We call him Baba Yaga. Boogeyman? Well, John wasn't exactly the boogeyman. He was the one you sent to kill the fucking boogeyman. Oh, John is a man of focus. Commitment. Sheer will. Something you know very little about. I once saw him kill three men in a bar with a pencil. With a fucking pencil. Would you kill John Wick for two million dollars? Make the arrangements. After all, you were close. And then you left, and the way you got out, lying to yourself that the past held no sway over the future, but in the end. A lot of us are rewarded for our misdeeds, which is why God took your wife and unleashed you upon me. This life follows you, clings to you, infecting everyone comes close to you. We are cursed, you and I. Do you know what was in that world? Artwork cash, not without its worth, but the leverage I had on this city. Priceless! Priceless! The bodies he buried that day laid the foundation of what we are now. And then my son, a few days after his wife died, you steal his car and kill his fucking dog. Father, I can make this right. Oh, how do you plan that? I'm finishing what I started. Good luck. And if you have done your job, my son will be still alive! speaking I heard you struck my son yes sir I did yeah, may I ask why yeah well because he stole John Wick's car sir and uh, killed his dog <laughs>